and you can start stringing these all these along. So, um, you know, you're not wearing the right shoes. How do you feel about that? Well, I don't feel that bad. I'm, you know, I mean, is, what's your big goal here? Is this your dream job? No, no. And uh, you know, you don't want to run this place? No. Would it break your heart this once just to let me in? How do you feel about that? It's a great little hack to throw back at any, um, any uh, put down that's thrown your way. Another really good one is if anyone's causing a scene, what are you trying to achieve here? Completely call them on what they're doing. What are you trying to achieve here? You know, in that awkward situation where somebody's talking a bit too loud, you know, you're, you're with your girlfriend in the bar and some guy's trying to mercilessly chat her up. Or what about the situation where somebody's just causing a racket? Just say, excuse me, hey, what are you trying to achieve here? Now they've got to justif justify themselves to you. And that lowers their status in doing that. So, of course, maybe you want to put people down. Maybe you're a bad person. Well, here's a line for you. My friend down the gym, you know, he did his weights, he beat his personal record, and he did it really good. And I was going to say to him, how do you feel about that? But he lifted the weight, he goes, I just lifted 120 kilograms, do you understand? I was like, uh, yeah, shit. You see, every hack has an equal and opposite hack. Any question, if you ever asked a question, and you don't want to answer, or you find trouble finding the answer, there's a lot of variables involved. You can pretty much answer any question with that hack. There's a lot of variables involved. But as I said, every hack has an equal and opposite hack. So equal hacks to that are, there's a lot of ingredients in the mix. There's a lot of factors at play. There's a lot of forces at work. They're all the same way of describing the same thing. Because language is pretty similar wherever you go. Just the style is different. Now. You might have a clever lecturer, you might have a clever boss who says, wait a minute, he's just hacked me. Well, you might not say that, but if he does, then you can counter. He, he, he may counter, he say, what do you mean there's a lot of variables involved? Get specific. Now he's turned the tables on you. So you have to hack him back. So this is what happens to me. Something like that happens, I go, oh, God, what could I have said? The learning we all get in life doesn't happen before we do it, uh, do the event. It happens after we take action. It happens after we walk home with our tail between our legs, we sit at our desk and think, oh, what was the perfect thing to say? I urge you to meditate on that, to think about that until you come up with that great answer. Because this is the answer I came back with. Get specific. What answer would satisfy you? <laughs> In other words, answer my own question for me. He said, don't play games with me. So I said, thinking, hack, hack, hack. You know what, any answer I give you, I can tell, is just going to add to more confusion. So, so it's like a one-up game all the time. And the more you do it, the more fun you have. So guys, um, any questions? Any normal questions? Well, if there's no more questions, would you like some more hacks? Oh, did you have a question? Oh, okay, you just. Okay, cool. Would it break your heart to have one? I mean, could you? <laughs> okay. All right. So, this is the world I'm living in right now. I'm always looking for these little lines, and uh, once a week, uh, my friend and I we just publish our latest one on our website, conversationhacks.com. And you know, we urge all of you, come in, share your ideas, share your, your thoughts. This is brand new. Uh, we don't think it's ever been done really before. These just these short, sharp little lines that we can use just to push buttons. Um, check out the site. You'll be able to uh, get hold of our seven, uh, seven ways to instantly influence anyone book. And um, You've been an amazing audience. Thank you so much.